Hello guys! I'm so excited for today's video because it's going to be a Taobao haul. Yeah. All these are the things that I bought and I've already opened this up and I'm not going to open any further for the video. So all these are still in the original parcel when they arrive in the China warehouse. So I'm going to open them up so that it will be easier for me when I do the unboxing haul. I'm going to remove all these boxes so as you can tell there are many many boxes and I think there are a total of about 15 or 16 parcels all from different sellers. So I'm just going to quickly open all this up for you guys so that when I do the unboxing haul later, it will be easier uh, for me to just open it up. So yeah, see you guys later. <laughs> So I'm a huge fan of buying stuff on Taobao because I feel like I need everything that I see on Taobao. Today is going to be another Taobao haul. I think this is my third Taobao haul on my channel, I believe. So this is just a really quick one because I have even more uh, Taobao stuff coming to my house. Recently Taobao had the 618 mid-year sale, I believe. And I bought so much stuff. Oh my god, I'm so excited to receive my stuff. So this is just some deco that I bought for my table because I'm going to do a desk makeover because I feel that my desk is so messy and I have so many things on my desk so I decided to buy some really nice and really aesthetic um, display for my desk today I will be unboxing together with you guys and yeah let's get started on today's video okay so the first box over here looks like this and I'm just going to quickly open this up Actually, I've already cut open like majority of the boxes because I can't wait to see what I purchased. I bought a lot of like deco stuff as I mentioned just now. So because the deco stuff are really really heavy, if I opt for air shipment, you'll be way too expensive. So I decided to go for C shipment and it took like about 2 weeks for my stuff to arrive. So by the time it reached my house, I have already forgotten what I bought. So Okay, so let's just quickly open this up. I think this is the deco that I bought for my desk. I will insert photos along the way to show you guys like how the item is supposed to look like. Because I think now everything is wrapped, you will not be able to see what exactly did I buy. This is quite nicely wrapped. Okay, the material is pretty good. And this is like the frame of the deco. Actually, what is the purpose of this? Okay, then I also have like a coat. So it says, Do it now, sometimes later becomes never. Okay, that's very true. Another quote is, Believe and the impossible becomes possible. Okay, so I will either display one of these or maybe I will just display a photo because the coat is not like the best. I mean, it's definitely not my favorite coat. So, oh my god, how to even remove this thing? I hate to remove this thing from. I hope it doesn't leave like any mark on my go hardware. I'm so bad at this. Okay, so. Okay, so I believe you're supposed to like hang this here. Then this is supposed to be here. Then. There will be a clip over here and this is supposed to be like this so this is how the deco is supposed to look okay i'll say that it looks pretty good okay so this is the first item that i bought i'm pretty satisfied with it and i hope i didn't buy anything that i will regret because like things always look good on Taobao as in the display image on Taobao always looks so good that makes me want to buy everything but in the end when i bought it sometimes I regret buying it because it is not like what I have imagined it or the quality is not the best. Opening up the second item, I totally cannot remember what is this also because it's been so long. This item comes with like a bag of tiny stones and it's quite heavy. Maybe that's why my shipping costs so much this time round. Okay, so I'm just going to dump like all the unused air bubbles or generally the waste into the box 
so that it's easier for me to dispose of them later after I record the video. And today is Saturday. My week feels so long. Oh. I can't remember what is this? Okay, so this is supposed to be like a vest, but it's not really a vest. Oh, maybe this is for like the previous item. This is obviously not like fresh or real flower. I mean plant. So I will just probably add some water to make it look nicer. But then there's like dengue fever going on right now, so I shouldn't be like leaving water in the tube. Okay, so this is how it looks like. This is the second item that I bought. I need to adjust them a little so it looks better. Okay, now it looks so much better. Wow, look at that. Okay, it's not bad. The next item is this pair of slip-on heels. I bought this pair of uh, slip-on heels for work. It looks really comfortable and recently it's quite trendy I guess like the nanny shoes the nanny style shoes is quite trendy I see a lot of like celebrities are wearing them so I decided to get one pair for myself and the material is pretty good it's like it feels like genuine leather but I don't think it's real leather overall I'm pretty satisfied with this pair of shoes just that because the shoe box has been compressed when I receive it so there's like a tiny mark on the shoes not sure if you're able to tell on camera so I'm just going to like stuff some bubble wrap into the shoes, stuff this in and leave it for maybe a few days before I wear them out. Life hack. This is the only pair of shoes that I got this time round. Usually I try my best not to buy shoes on Taobao. I usually like to try out the shoes before I buy them and usually if I don't try the shoes, it's either, it's either too small or too big for me and shoes this kind of thing, it really has to be very comfortable unless you are basically buying like a piece of junk. So um, after years of buying shoes on Taobao, I realized that it's not worth the risk. I might as well just buy in Singapore when I can try it in store, which is so much more feasible compared to like buying on Taobao. Life hack. Okay, moving on to the next item. This is no idea what is it, so I'm just going to open it. Probably another home deco item. So first when I open pasta, right, I will be wondering, do I even buy them? Then, it will take me like a few seconds to remember Oh yes, actually I did buy them What is this? Eww! Oh, okay, I think I remember now oh. Okay, that was fun for 2 seconds This is a candle stand for my candle This is how it looks like. I will basically hang this over here, the hook over here, and the candle will be placed into this tiny holder over here. So obviously there's another one in the box and I'm going to open it now. Oh, I'm pretty satisfied with this. It looks really, really aesthetic. Oh, I really like to squeeze this. It's so fun. Okay, I better use the scissors in case it drops and breaks. Okay, so this is the second one. Then again, I will hook this over. Oh, it's so nice. Look at this. So aesthetically pleasing. Okay, I'm pretty satisfied with this. Then now I will be opening up the candle. I can't remember what other scents that I bought. Oh, but it smells pretty good. Oh, it smells really good. Okay, so this is in the scent. Um, English pear and frisia, which it, which translates to Ying Guo Li He Xiao Chang Lan. Is that a flower or no idea? Okay, so this is how the candle looks like. It's just like really tiny, but it looks like the Joe Malone uh, candle packaging. <laughs> really, really like this. It is so nice and it totally match the overall vibe that I envision for my desk which is like gold and black so my desk is in black color and I want the 
hardware or the deco to be in gold and this is like black and gold which is perfect and it match my table I bought two candles in total the first one that I bought was uh, English pear and this is actually in the same scent as well actually I can't remember what are the scent that I chose so okay next item is this okay so I bought like a box of Hai Chi Jia's Suan La Fen, which is like super famous on Instagram and Facebook right now. So this is the Hai Chi Jia Suan La Fen and it's all over the internet right now. And personally, I have tried a lot of Suan La Fen all over the world because I really, really, really love eating Suan La Fen. So um, the best one that I tried is definitely in China. So I will probably do a video of me trying uh, the Suan La Fen also. So I know that some people might be skeptical when it comes to buying food on Taobao but come on, all the stuff that you bought I mean all the food that you bought from Shopee or Lazada they are all imported from China which is Taobao so just saying okay so this is like the box of Hai Chi Jia Sang La Fen that I bought I will not be opening up everything it's basically like a box of 6 Sang La Fen and I can't wait to try them because it looks really really nice and yeah Okay, so the next box of food that I bought is also instant noodle. This is the Guangdong Zhu Su Shi Fen. So the difference between this one and the Hai Chi Jia Suan La Fen is that this is more of a mala flavor instant noodle. Okay, they are not really noodle, but okay, let's just call them noodles. So um, another difference is that for this Guangdong Zhu, right, there are many different ingredients inside. So I think there's like a fish ball. There are fish balls and Looks like there is squid inside, but I don't know. So I've never tried this before and I can't wait to try it also. And in the box, there are also like sausages. So these are like the sausages that you are supposed to put into the Guangdong Zhu also. And I've tried this sausage in China before. So this is from the brand Shanghui, which is a very famous sausage brand in China. And I've tried them before and it's really, really good. So I can't wait to try this also. Okay, the next item, which is also food. So this is the Taiwan Nougat Biscuit. I tried this the first time when I was in Taiwan and I really 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 love it. It tastes so good. My favorite biscuit of all time to ever exist. So I saw it on Taobao also and I decided to buy them. But um, for this type of biscuit right, it's best to consume them when you first purchase it because it's like fresh and soft and nice and all. So because I chose um sea shipping and when it arrived in my place like a few days ago, it was already probably two weeks after the biscuits were made. So it's not as fresh as how it tastes in Taiwan, but it still tastes good lah. So as you can tell, I've already like finished more than half the packet. <laughs> it's so addictive, I love it. You should totally try it out if you have never tried this before. So yeah, this is also another deco that I bought for my desk. So let me just cut open. Uh, ooh, it doesn't feel very light or frimsy. It actually feels really sturdy and it doesn't feel like the cheap kind of metal that you get from Daiso. This feels pretty heavy and of really good quality. Okay, that's not bad. So I'm going to put like my pants and probably my lip balm. I'm still thinking of what I'm going to put inside here so you can check out my desk makeover video to find out what I've actually put inside this thing. So again, I chose the gold hardware because um, the overall vibe of my desk is going to be gold. Next, what is this? Feels pretty heavy. Oh, okay, okay, I remember this. Okay, so this is like a... This is technically like a piece of leaf. Not sure if you can tell, it's a bit reflective on the camera. So this is for my accessories. It's like a accessories um plate. This looks really nice and oh my god, it feels really heavy also. Wow, this totally like changed the overall vibe of my desk. It looks so nice, oh my god, I love it. So I'm just going to display on my desk and I will put like my rings or like my bracelets on it and it's just like grab and go, it's really convenient and oh my god, it's so nice, I like it. Okay, next I have another piece of deco. So this is like a tiny tray for me to put like my random stuff and my table is 
extremely messy right now you can literally find anything on my table so i'm just going to put like the uncategorized stuff into this like tiny tray so that the other parts of the table will look tidy and clean except for this tray this is just like the i don't know what that is but you are on my table tray <laughs> does it even make sense okay moving on to the last few items this is a hairband that I bought so you know usually when I record like makeup tutorial I will put my hair to the back because I don't want my hair to get in the way so usually I will wear like my tiny pink ribbon which I bought when I was in secondary school and it has been over 10 years since I got it so I decided to get this cute little bear hairband for my video to get my hair out of the place the next time when I do my makeup tutorial I will be using this and you guys will be seeing it also Oh, it's so cute. I like it. Okay, so this is the last item that I bought from my Taobao haul. And now, oh my god, the floor is in a complete mess. I'm just going to like tidy up the mess that I have created before my mom comes into my room and nag at me. Okay, so that completes today's video. And if you enjoy watching my Taobao haul, I will be uploading another Taobao haul real soon. As soon as I receive my 618 parcel. So, yeah. Remember to subscribe to my channel for more videos. So see you guys next time. Bye!